Okay. So I'm I was having this bug earlier on a uh, Red Dead Redemption and uh by the title you probably know what it was. So I don't want to go into explaining. I'm just trying to do this as quick as possible. Let me actually show my um desktop icons so I can do this. Okay. The game do not run the game right now. Just first things first. Do not run the game if you have it installed. Most likely, this is what it looked like for me. I'll have this as the uh, the thumbnail. Profiles was the only file that was here whenever I downloaded the game. And Cloud Save Data was the only other file inside of it. In the uh, documents, here's the uh, discovery right here. So it's uh, documents, Rockstar, and Red Dead 2. This is what everyone says to go to to replace the XML file for, uh, for it. Here's my original settings. This system XML. So don't do that. Don't remake it. Okay. All you're going to do is this. Look, I'll redo it and then I'll delete the settings again. But um, just add in settings and that's it. That's literally all you do. And then um, you just run the game. And this took me hours to do. Remind you, like I was changing my audio. I was changing like everything. Like it was just not working. I did this and it fixed a lot. Now I was having problem with cloud saving, but I'm pretty sure that's a different subject from this. There's multiple bugs running this game first time, uh, FPS bugs, uh, just texture bugs, just a lot. Like this game is really bad on PC. Personally, I know some people probably are having a blast, you know, but um, for me, it took me a while. See, it's uh, there we go. So it's gonna run at full default settings. So this is actually going to be really buggy if it's going to show just. Okay, no, it's actually not. Okay, so I'm back in 1920 by 1080. The game is running at 21, 21, seven, seven, no, 2715 by something else. And this is what the game looks like. It looks like horrible. It just looks terrible. So if you change the settings, now with the new settings folder, usually whenever you would change it without the settings, so okay, I already replaced it. But um if you if you ran this game without settings, a oh, settings file, whenever you change these, the variables have no way of changing. Like like these don't change without a file to have the proof of you changing them. So if you change the screen type to full screen, there's nothing in the file saying that you change it to full screen. That's the problem. So if you change it to full screen now, and then, here, let me get my remote. You enter it, now it's windowed, right? So if it was full screen and now it's windowed, uh, you go to full screen, fix the, uh, the resolution, which would go back to default automatically because it had no, no way to change. It's gonna fix itself. And as you can see, it's back. And you can do this for literally everything. Literally everything. You can unlock this. Don't download the graphics thing. Whatever someone said, this thing, let me show you. This is like horrible. I don't do this. Don't go to apps and don't go to uh, optional features. View. Don't download this. This is not, this didn't fix anything. It made the gun, the game run at a locked advanced graphics settings. And that's it. It doesn't change anything. This is like locking your graphics. That's all it does. It's not good. And it does it for all your other games. That's it. All right.